What's going on YouTube? Hey, it's been a it's been a little while since it's been a little while since I uh, posted a video, but got a new project I'm working on, and the banana boat still ain't even finished yet. But got another project we're working on too. But we're gonna slowly. I think we're gonna slowly get this together over the winter, or either I'm gonna just put a little quick fix on it and then I'm just gonna probably uh I'm probably gonna um probably flip that like sell it because I mean it's I don't know I got it for a good price and I could probably make some good money off of it I'm just just being honest but uh here we go I'll show you what we're working on uh give me one second Grand Marquise. Mercury Grand Marquise. Got big baby right there. Still, she dirty as hell right now, too. Look at her. She dirty. Grand Marquise. Get y'all a better view of it right there. Um, when I got the car, the car, the front clip on it was bad. It had a small, I guess it was, it was cracked real bad. Uh, so I just wanted to go ahead and change the whole front clip. Um, I went to, to a pick and pull, a little junkyard. Went and got that front clip right there. And I got two grills, but of course I'm only gonna use one. Um, this front clip right here is gonna be painted to match the paint code on this Grand Marquise right here. Big baby right there. Yeah, sure. She uh, she dirty as hell right now, though, man. I need to pay her some attention. Got a couple of projects we're working on. Monte Carlo Cadillac 74 over there. The 74 right there going on 30s. But yeah. This is the thing right here right now. We're working on this Merc. Um this Merc is a 2000. Of course it's got the 4.6 in it. Um Well, I'm gonna be honest, one thing I don't like about the older models is because the older models have spindles and they don't have like upper control arms on it. I rather have upper control arms and spindles because when you when you tend to extend spindles, sometimes they break. And I ain't trying to be going through all that on the road. You know that uh the Lincoln has upper control arms. Same suspension, just like a Crown Vic. Ain't no different. Same chastity. But uh, this Merc right here, you know, it's a little older, but still pretty much the same body as like the Crown Vicks, the newer Crown Vicks. I mean, everything pretty much interchanges, but I got the spindles on the front suspension, and I just do not like that. And I'll show you. I haven't done anything to it at all. Anything. I ain't touched the inside. Inside is dirty. But with a good little clean. Good little detailing to it. Oh, she'll be good to go. Um, it's got 182,000 miles on the dash. I mean, really... Anybody that know these cars, man, 182,000 miles ain't nothing for these cars. I mean, these cars will ride forever. Got a toolbox out here. Ready to go to work. But uh, I'm going to keep y'all updated on this process right here, though, man. I'm going to definitely keep y'all updated on this process right here. Mm-hmm.
when I get done with it, she gonna look a uh, she gonna look a little different from this right here. Got this money collar right here. She don't look all that right now, but she about to get sprayed. She about to get sprayed. Then she got these twenty eights on her. She getting there. Got a brand new transmission inside of her, and it's pulling strong. Cadillac right here, 28 on this. About to go crazy. This Cadillac about to get a little uh, extra work, a little detail work done to it. Um, gold lips about to go on it. Oh, this Cadillac about to be crazy. It's about to look good. Big baby over there. She gonna get sprayed again too. But yeah, I'm gonna definitely keep y'all updated on this uh this Merc right here, man. Y'all just stay tuned. All right, YouTube, we out. All right, YouTube. So, see, I got the front panel. It's been primed down. It's been nicely primed. And I'm about to spray it with the paint. I got the paint code inside of the can. Paint code inside of the can right here. Getting ready to spray that. And uh, I guess we're going to see how it turns out. Uh, I'm going to get back with y'all here in just a few.